you know, I, lo I love doing children's projects. I really, truly do. And, um, uh, you know, on the one hand, because of the project, but on the other hand, it's quite nice to come home and have your kid go, hey, Dad, <laughs> you know, that was, you know, the, the, I heard your soundtrack, or I played your game, or I saw your movie, and it wasn't so bad. answer is, I am a kid. You know, um, one of the huge advantages you have as a musician is you never ever are expected to really grow up because it's not a job, it's I play music. So, you know, the, um, the operative word here being play. Um, and getting into this world it really isn't that hard for me because the world is beautiful and the world is incredibly well designed and um, crafted and lots of very talented artists have thought about this very hard and you just let yourself fall in and you live in that world for a while and you know automatically the right things will happen. It's, it's nice when, when storylines that we are given or, or things we get to write about are based in myth, you know, so, so um, it's fun if you can draw on ancient ideas. I mean, people have been writing about these sort of mythical ways of, of seeing our world or seeing any world or describing a world forever, you know, so there's a, there's a huge heap of great music that has come before this. Um, and the fun thing is that, in a way, the fable or the storytelling or the fairy tale is still alive and being told in a new way in, through, through these games.